Assalamu alaikum dear student today I am going to start the word problem okay word problems in our last lectures I had complete additions and the subtractions but now solving this one okay that is this word problems okay if first of all study the following examples so the examples number one what happened in examples number one if a shopkeeper has 150 grams, 150 kg, 500 grams of rice, sales, 75 kg, 750 grams, how much rice will be left? So here required subtractions. Why? Because, because the 150 kg and 500 grams is the total amount which is sold by the 75 kg, 750 grams. So, remain, how many amount is remain after selling? Okay, now see. This is our kg and this is our gram. Okay, now the kg unit is written in, in the following of kg and the gram value is written in the following of gram. Okay, so first of all see 150 kg and 500 gram is subtracted by 75 kg 750 gram so see 500 is less than 750 gram so what happened 1 kg is given to this borrow this one okay now the 1 kg is borrowed to the gram so 1 gram is equal to how many gram sorry 1 kg is equal to how many gram 1 kg is equal to 1000 gram. So, 1000 plus 500. 1000 plus 500 is equal to 1500. So, the here total amount is 1500. It's easy to subtract 750. Why? Because, because when we borrow this amount from the gram, from the kg. So, 1500 is subtracted by 750 the value is 750 is remain okay now here 150 kg is given but when we given 1 kg to the gram so after that it has only 149 so 149 is subtracted by 75 so 9 is subtracted by 5 the value is 4 and the 14 is subtracted by 7 the value is 7 Therefore, the 74 kg 750 grams of rice is left after selling. Okay. Now see the next questions. The problem said two. Okay. A can of milk has 20 liter, 450 ml of milk. So the another can has 18 liter 8 1800 ml how much milk is there in two cans altogether so here a liter liter is the large value then the ml so here take a ml so in the first case 20 liter and 450 ml in another case the 18 liters and 800 ml so it want how many amounts of milks are formed all together okay so additions is required 0 is 0 5 is 5 8 plus 8 plus 4 is equal to 12 so here is the 12 1250 ml so less than 1000 so 1000 is equal to how much 1000 ml milk is equal to how many liters so one liter so one is given to that's one here take only two so eight plus one nine two plus one three so here is the total quantity of milk is 39 liters 250 ml okay now see our next questions that is problem set three at a speed of 90 kilometer per hour what distance will a train cover in two and half hours okay 
Now see, the speed of train is 90 km per hour. That is, that is, it travels 90 km in 1 hour. It travels 90 more km in the second hour. So, in the next half an hour. So, first of all, we find out the speed, speed of half an hour because it won't two and half hours so one hours one hour speed is 90 kilometers so half hour speed is 45 kilometer because 90 is divided by 2 so the value is 45 kilometer so it won't two and half hours one hours speed is 90 kilometers another one hours speed is plus 90 kilometers and the half an hour speed is 45 kilometer so among all the three value is add the answer is 225 kilometer okay now add this three value the answer is 225 kilometer now see the next questions okay the remaining three questions it will be solved in our last lectures Allah